Let's take a look at how we can create a custom white balance for our newer Sony Alpha cameras, models released in 2019 or later, and also the uh, A9 camera with the version 5 update. Now, if you want to create a custom white balance rather than using the auto white balance, you're probably doing this because you want to shoot movies or you don't want to be standardizing white balance in post-production. It's also a very accurate way of creating a completely neutral white balance. Now, in order to do this, we're going to need a white balance reference. Some people will use a white piece of uh, paper, but you can actually create a more accurate white balance using a specific white balance reference. This is an X-Rite color checker that I'm using in this instance. We're going to uh, start this by going into the menus. You may have assigned white balance to a custom key or the FN menu. Now, going up from auto white balance, we'll go across in custom three and hit the center button to hit the set. We'll hit the center button a second time to create a white balance reference and then a third time to enter that as the working white balance. Now there are going to be instances where you don't actually want to create a completely neutral white balance and in this instance let's just go back into the white balance. Let's go um, back uh, and do a white balance custom two setting. We'll cycle right hit the center button again to hit a, a reference and then uh, moving right again we can now modify the neutral white balance to a white balance maybe with a warm tone. Let's take a look at those two differences in white balance that I've just created. Let's go back into the white balance. Um, setting 3 is neutral, setting 2 is slightly warm. Okay, so that's how we create a white balance reference in the newer Sony Alpha cameras. Thank you.